what do we got playing in today's set? Ten at four seventy. Fifty recovery. Ninety easy. Oh, I'm in at two forty. It's gonna get the sweat dripping. Five at forty at two ninety five. Looks all right on paper, but. Probably die. I've learnt my lesson not to say any of these look easy because being a fan up. Uh, because I say that and I do them, and that's the worst thing I've ever done. So we'll just um, take this one as it goes. Just day five of doing these workouts in a row. I've only lately been riding every second day, so... Bit of a kick to the nuts doing them every day. It's Cadence up at Smidge, eh? This Paris course is nice. Oh, I've got a new camo jersey. Should put that on. I can pause this workout on my phone. Quickly do it. Companion. time to blast this effort. Although in erg mode like I am now, uh, 10 seconds is too short for like this to adjust to my cadence. Let's see. One ten. These sprints are silly, to be honest. I don't rate these at all. Because you can basically just crank your, um, your cadence, which is even what it's asking me to do. Um, 110. You bang up to like 500 plus watts. You're already five seconds deep. The erg mode tries to adapt, by the time it levels off at 470, the 10 second effort's over. So, ready, have a look. So we ramp, we're at, see 560, 120 RPM, tries to compensate down, tries to compensate up, see and by the time it hits 470, It's over. I guarantee you I don't get a star for this. So each that list down the left side, if you do it correctly, gets a star. See at the bottom, zero out of twelve stars. 
I didn't get the warm up either. Did. Maybe because I stopped to put this new kit on, but I did pause it. No one. Yeah, this is still just an extended warm up, to be honest. I did that one more consistently. But oh, man, look at my heart rate. It's still in the 130s. Like going into this after a three minute tick over the legs. Yeah. I don't know about this one so far. See, this one changed the wattage before, and there's no way I'll get that to 110. <coughs> Odd. Oh well. It's all in the effort, I say. I'm putting in the effort. The 40 seconds at 295 look good. I can't even remember what the name of this session was called. Or would it be? Five minutes at 2.40, that's not far off FTP. FTP is 2.68, so starting to nudge out pretty close. How am I dropping out? I reckon fuck this auto connected I reckon via Bluetooth instead of and you know what let's Bluetooth up on the phone see what happens Let's get this workout under control. This is it's been a rough start. <laughs> yeah, so what happened was I, I turned on Zwift and I got on the bike. I was like, oh, I can't pick up the trainer, that's weird. And I was like, oh shit, I didn't, um, I didn't plug it in. So I got off the bike, plugged it in, got back on the bike, and it sort of then, like, had auto-picked them up. And it just advances itself to the next, like, workout and map select screen. Like, without me clicking it. Um, and seeing as the last time I did this, I used on Ant, I was... I guess I wrongly assumed that it would just pick up the last connection method once it detected him. But no, I think it's it's going back to uh, back to Bluetooth as we get another dropout on cue. And again, this uh, this is not. Zwift's issue. It's a shitty computer Bluetooth. Uh, losing connection. When it's... 3 metres, 2 metres away. Direct line of sight. Uh, 
Legs feel pretty good actually though after just the endurance ride yesterday. Finish this set strong. One thirty five for two minutes. No cadence target. Oh, so I got a new got a new trainer mat in the mail this morning. So, carpet is protected, which is um, it's cool. Ordered on Amazon. It must have only been like Thursday, and it was, it was, it said like mid September, expected delivery, and I got it two days later on a Saturday morning. So that was pretty good. So I had a bit of, I've had a headache all day to be honest and I was almost going to pull the pin on this. So I do wanted me to pull the pin on this. But one I can't do that to you guys. And by you guys I mean the no one who was watching in chat. And number two, I want to try out this new mat. So He's hoping this set gets harder and I sweat all over it and it pulls up beauty. You know what I am noticing from all these back-to-back -back indoor sessions? My shoes are starting to stink. I imagine because I'm sweating in my feet and there's no airflow going past my feet. So it's just like pulling, you know, coming straight through my socks into my shoes. Just absorbing into them. See, they stink. Alright, 5 at 240. This will be solid. Old 90. Old 90. Here we go. I'm gonna get real tilted if I see dropouts. First impression, legs feeling good. I'll say that one minute in to a five minute set. I'd have done that. I was moving on this mountain bike. Let's <sighs> keep an eye on heart rate and see whether we are staying under threshold. We are like locked on. We're not. We're not. That zero watts just killed me. That dropout just killed me. There's another one. Let me get back on. Halfway through this set. Done.
He's definitely moving that bloke. Things are getting heavy. Oh, too soon. Maybe if he can draft off me because I'm in a workout. Oh, that's what he's doing. He's pumping a fair wattage though. Yikes, this is sore. I was thinking. I'd go alright in the next FTP. 20 minutes is so long. So heart rate stayed in the 150s for like that whole set, which is good. I think that yeah validates my threshold heart rate pretty good. See a Vasily smashing it. Let's work. Give you steady power. Starts nicely. A bit rude now. Man, he's blasting me like my eyes are getting dried out. Oh, it's pretty warm today. 20 degrees in Victoria, which is nice. So if I turn this fan down a bit, it will be a sweat fest. I see people commenting up the top. Sounds like they're doing fun shit together. Like, ah, oh, I want to be in that session. <laughs> sure you don't rock your hips. Hips are already rocking in this cool down. Give it a go. Two ninety five for forty. I guess it's just mashed down a little bit harder than 
what I was doing. Red, what revs do you want? 95. Right, let's try. Hips steady. That's the wattage I'll have to push in the FTP because 20 minute you take 95% of your wattage. So to get an improvement on 268, I'll need to be up around that 290, 295. Not horrible yet. I like the short recoveries here. Yeah, get around me. Right in. Not too bad. No one to go. It's probably been the easiest work set I've gone for so far. Heart rate's still looking good. For anyone watching, my heart rate is naturally high. Just lost me tower. That is devastating news going into the last set.
24 second delay. <laughs> yeah, I just unlocked this camo kit yesterday. So it'll do till we get catacomb in here. People need a catacomb Zwift kit. Simon Clark. Too easy. And set done. And I didn't mind that. Alright, can I get this towel off the ground while it's still clipped in? I'll wait till the five minute rest. I'm sweating everywhere though. So I do need it. You guys. I had to clip out. Hamstrings were not flexible enough. And now I'm way in the high gear. Crossed. Disable this erg mode. Oh, there we go. Yeah, so it adapts the resistance to your cadence. Then because I stopped, cranked it. Ooh. Well, there goes the star for this part of the workout on the left there. Ooh. Yeah, it would be sweet. I have to look into how to do it because there aren't a lot of brands with kits in here. Um, whether it's something you have to pay for. I don't know. I guess I'll wait till I release my kit and then get onto them. Because then people will have the actual real life kit and then the virtual kit. That would be cool. Or it'd be cool as well if you bought, you bought a kit comes with like a virtual kit. That would be awesome. I imagine Swift don't want to be making hundreds of kits for every bike brand out there though, so I don't know how that would work. But I mean surely adding some graphics to like existing kit template assets within Zwift is not excuse me, is not that hard a deal. Imagine this tie-dye undershirt style on a kid in Zwift. I don't know if you guys can see that through the camera. But that would look awesome, I reckon. I will absolutely model the kit on here for you when it's ready. Well, in fact, I'm wearing the bib shorts now. Hard for you to see, and hard for me to lift a leg while I'm riding. If there's anyone at the end of the ride who wants to see, I can stand up and sneak a preview. Jersey's what you want to see though, that thing looks incredible. It's just a random hanging around. Godinho, what a name. It's like uh, Ronaldinho, but it's the god. Godinho. Hey, if anyone's watching and is interested and wants to ride with, just reach out in chat. We'll make it happen. I'd love to get a crew. New mat, mopping up the sweat well.
So can you believe the top end branded mats to 120 bucks Australian and the exact same mat, same surface, same thickness, same material, half price, 60. I used to shop around. All right, here we go. Second round of these sprints. 40 at 2.95. This time the recovery is 10 seconds less. And you get a 20 second recovery. I like this. These short sprints that are just a little bit bigger than a balls out sprint, longer, these suit me well. Like I can grind my power like this. I think that's what my body's suited to. But this keeps freaking dropping out. I'll throw this microphone through the computer screen. seconds are going to go by quicker and quicker and quicker. So, it hurts, because it's 40 seconds, it's a comfortable hurt. It doesn't build up to like the levels where you want to cry. These 20 seconds, someone got a stopwatch on these? Getting shorter and shorter. Well, I'm here I do kind of love the hair because since they're shorter rides, I guess it's good just to get on, smash yourself for an hour and get off. Versus when you're out on the road, it goes for ages, which I'd much rather be out on the road, but I wouldn't want to mimic a road ride on here. Like anything over an hour here. I start to go brain dead. Um, that dropout has just destroyed me. Um, so yeah, if it's just going to be an hour, like hurting. Don't swerve around him. Straight line to the blue. I'm going to go. That heart rate, I have to double check what my threshold heart rate is. It's starting to get pretty close. Not lose the tower this time.
Mission strong. So, when was it? Not, not yesterday, Thursday. The first one on here, that was the worst one. I was in a world of pain. A minute at 470 toward the end of the hour set. That was rough. Good though. Is the headache's gone? Increased blood flow, pumping whatever the hell it was out of there. Gotta do on one of these. Go okay, helmet, glasses, works. I still didn't bring a tissue box. Sniffing for the whole thing. This dropout's brutal. I could just turn Bluetooth off this computer, to be honest, because I don't use it for anything else. That way, there's no way it can connect through that. Potato cam. Uh oh. I did up the um I up to the bit rate again. I figured I'll just keep nudging it higher and higher and higher and see how good it can go, because the higher it is the clearer it is. So it's at like twelve thank you, twelve meg. It could be that your your playback is playing back potato cam because the rate is too high. for this last set of sprints. Great running. Imagine trying to type trying to type comments whilst running on a treadmill. With no spelling mistakes or fat fingers. It's impressive. It's not staying potato cam. Looks like you have a minion helping you out behind the scenes. <laughs> yeah. Little little minion I keep in the cupboard. Got this live stream on loop 24-7. So it can come out if it hears me call.
probably it's just one of the many fans, I think. Probably just walking down the street, watching this on their phone. Heard the call for help. And just ran in. I don't know what else it could have been. Alright, here we go. Last sprint set. No dropouts. Please Bluetooth. Be kind to me. Fucking heaps of dropouts. Fuck you, Bluetooth. Who's excited for Tour de France tonight? That's good. Yeah, I mean, the other... Like, I can keep cranking the bitrate to get it to look better. But, yeah, the problem is if it's too high for people to play back, um, that's not worth it because it'll just appear blurry on everyone's thing because they can't handle the high bitrate. Especially in Australia where our internet is potato anyway. Things are starting to feel heavy. excitement for they're finishing this set starting to get up there because I know there's lasagna le lasagna for dinner afterwards that's the best bit about doing a ride before you don't feel guilty when you smash three or four helpings plus dessert that was a quick 20 Here we go. But next to me is punching as well. It's not quite quick enough, bud. Oh, is he? Oh, fuck you. You got me. Nah, nah, hats off. Nice work. Mama, this is hurting the legs.
And done. Easy. That was, to be honest, probably the easiest workout we've had yet. What was your peak heart rate? Did anyone see? I reckon it was maybe Lunch, don't mind me. Alright, so out of the 12 stars on offer in this workout, we got six. Hopefully, we get seven here. But yeah, the Bluetooth dropouts don't help. Erg mode for this short sprint workout doesn't help. Dropping the towel doesn't help. But in terms of a training response, like. The resistance on the trainer doesn't change, so, you know, the work was done. No blood, reasonable amount of sweat, a couple of tears from this fan. Oh, one more to go tomorrow and then that's week one done. I think. I feel like there's only six workouts for the week. Um, wish you could go to like Zwift have a website and you could log in and you could see the plans so you sort of know it's coming up because unless you look then you don't know so next time I'll screenshot it when I start the ride This is stop two. Not bad, Tommy. Two minutes left. Just warm down. Cool down, I should say. Thanks for watching, anyone who did. Appreciate it. Always good to have people riding. Even if you give me shit, to be honest, gives me something to look at. Take my mind off pushing through some of these sets. And that's only week one done of this four week FTP workout list on Zwift, so it's only going to get harder from here on out. Which means I'm only going to need more comments and more distractions from you guys. Especially as the intervals get longer. I adjusted the fan a little bit and I feel like my hands are not sweating as much. But also my eyes are watering now because it is literally blasting me in the eyeballs. Um, yeah. Last minute. I don't remember there's like a 24 second delay because I think at the end what I've been doing is like saying bye, clicking stop, and then it, it, it insta stops, no delay. So 
and then it cuts off and you don't see me say goodbye. So we're gonna remember I'll say goodbye. Show the ride stats. Count 24 seconds. And then kill the stream. Done. What do we get? 167 heart rate. Said 165. That's not bad. So for anyone interested, here's hopefully a better view of the Catacomb Cycling tie-dye undershirt. Bibs. Hard to show the bibs, actually. But another time. Alright, thanks everyone. Catch you all later.